Those who accepted these positions, Gen Z's cannot come out to fight for you. And then you, you behave like hyenas. Gen Z's died. People died. Other Kenyans died because of this. You are not party to it. Why should you accept these positions? That is a show of greed. And that should never be tolerated. That is a decision I'm giving as Baku Awino, not as ODM. Although I'm in ODM. They are saying, the agency are saying, it's high time Baku Awino to be in the Gen Z's are saying that, uh, we Gen Z's have said that. <laughs> 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 they are saying you as the new opposition leader. Yeah. yeah, actually, from today henceforth, I'm the chief opposition leader. Because there are so many jobs doing rounds. There are so many people who are in the opposition, who are now in bed with the government. My interest is to fight for it pains me, it pains me to see a person who was a fellow member of parliament joining government. And it pains me to look back in Soweto slums, Kibra slums, to look back in central region, Nyanza coast and everywhere else, to see that child who has been sent away because he lacks only 5,000 to pay for the schooling in a secondary school. Sent because of 5,000. I'm so pained to see that child who's stuck in hospital cannot be treated because they lack money. Even money for x-ray that is around only 2,500. If you can't afford it, then you can't even be x-rayed. I'm so pained to see our young men and women moving around without jobs, seeing a border border rider in the sun from morning to evening only gaining 50 shillings to 100 shillings in a day. Seeing a mama mboga, selling mboga, selling omena. 